Hello everyone, welcome Hi guys. back to our channel. Welcome. Today is a mixture of a work day and a date day. It's yeah. a Saturday. Yeah, it's a Saturday. That is what it is. Yeah. We are in the car park of Starbucks. I know, glamorous, unique, but we are going, we're going to sit and we're going to do a... Typey, typey, type, type. Lappy, toppy, toppy, top. For um, happy, healthy, homo stuff. Yeah, we're going to sit and like plan it. Because for people who don't know, we, mm -hmm. we do a podcast and we have our own channel out and it takes planning, obviously. Yeah. But... We've both got our own stuff going on, so it yeah. takes. So we always kind of do it on the fly, mm -hmm. <laughs> which is not great um, and not good for your stress levels. No. So we're going to. We've say got loads of stuff to go through. Yeah. But I'm really excited because I, well, I think when you enjoy work as well, it's like this is quite fun to come to. Well, oh, we've turned it into a nice, fun little thing. Coming to a coffee shop with our laptops, we can have a meeting. And then what are we doing for our date that you organised? Yeah, we're going pottery painting. Pottery painting. Potter. I can't wait. Last time I did that as a kid, I did a dog bowl. But I think this time I'm going to do a human bowl. I might do an egg cup. Oh, nice. No, I'm an That's egg probably cup, the cheapest I? one. I did you could do a set of six. A set of six. <laughs> I don't really care. For, of all the types of ways to cook an egg, a boiled egg is the worst. Yeah, I don't. I, I don't mind it, but I don't ever want to dip into a runny yolk. Mm. We were supposed to do this on Wednesday. I just went, mm, like, really mm, uh, dismissive. dismissive. You're so dismissive. <laughs> Thursday. Was it Thursday? Wednesday. Oh, it was Wednesday. It was Wednesday, because we moved the kids so we could do oh, it. Yeah. And then Fen had eaten... Two bags of chocolate. Two bags of Revels, which have raisins in. And so he was hospitalised on Wednesday. So we had to cancel. We've Instead of cancelling, we rearranged two today. So we've got a mixture of work and... And date pottery. and pleasure. Harry Pottery. Harry Pottery. Come to die. <laughs> I can't wait. The boy who painted. Are we going to go for Nando's later? Maybe. I mean, he's the one. We organised last month. I organised our date, which was an escape room. And did we do? No, just escape room. Yeah, we're going to say I didn't realise food was included. In yes, the please. <laughs> Wasn't included in my day. I enjoyed that escape room. It was so fun. Was they doing a Christmas Eve themed room where it's like you've got to escape for Christmas Eve or something? I don't know, mm, I don't know if I care for novelty escape rooms. <laughs> well, you don't know yet. You've never tried. Well, I know, but I just feel I'm not generally a novelty kind of person. And on that note. And on that note. So let's go <laughs> to the very generic Starbucks. Because <laughs> we're going to commandeer this table. I mean, if anyone wants to sit with us, they can, but nice to have lots of workspace. Right, work done. That was like 10 seconds for you guys. It was two hours Two for hours for us. But anyway, we're off to pottery paint now. It was, I mean, you are far too excited for this. I'm so excited. I love being creative, guys. He's the logical one, I'm the creative one. I, well, you've said that that's not true. You said I am creative. You are creative, yeah. But you are, and also I am logical, but. Because things don't exist in isolation, do they? <sighs> Keegan's favourite new phrase. Things don't exist in isolation. No, am I right though, guys? They don't, and people forget that. <laughs> and I think it's important to remind people of that. Yes, good things work. Have an, things have an effect, the butterfly effect. Right. Anyway. We're going to take you into this pottery place now, and we're going to enjoy a bit of creativity and leave our logical selves at the door. Am I not? I'm not very artistically um, gifted. I think that's what I meant. I mean, I'm not either. I'm not very, I wish I could draw. I wish I could do art. I don't. Oh. I don't, like, I'm not, it'd just be something else that I don't have time to do. <laughs> that's the spirit. That's the spirit, yeah. Anyway, come along with us on our date. Not night, not date day, but date a couple of hours. Could I do, could you do like a Christmas, could you do yeah. a Christmas ball ball oh, thing? Oh yeah, we That's could do. Cute. Yeah, we could do Christmas themed. You could even, you were saying about a mug, you could do a Christmas mug. No, I don't want to do a mug. We it, Like, we're inundated. No, but that's what I mean. Around. Don't do a normal mug because we've got loads, but every Christmas you could get out your Christmas mug. Mm. We'll see. I've come a stupid way here. Yeah, you have. I'm doing a jog. Joe, what are you doing? And these are what the colours come out of. I did do like three coats because it gets fired in the kiln. Yeah. So I'm, I think I'm just going to divvy it up into sections and do different yeah. colours and patterns okay. and things. And did you use those? Um, there's loads of different stuff that we could have done, um, but we've gone, we've gone in here, haven't we? Yeah. 
we started big. I did ask my mum for Christmas either a garish vase or a classy vase. And so I what think you she's got me a classy one, so I might do a garish vase. You're going to make yourself a garish <laughs> vase, okay? Yeah. Stay tuned. You can win. Ships. <laughs> I'm more boring than you, you go for loads of cars. I'm more boring than you. I just go for simple. We're just finishing up and uh, Keegan is doing his, finishing his second, third coat. This has been the most enjoyable two hours in recent memory. Isn't it? It's so fun. Mine, I think I've gone a bit crazy, but it's okay. I wanted it to be crazy. Concentration. So concentrated. The concentration. Oh, it's been the best twelve hours of my life. Vegan has really enjoyed it. More so than me. Ah. Say goodbye to them now. Yeah, we go in the kiln. Dead. Signed. Well, what did you think? I that was that was real. Like I really enjoyed it. Yeah, that was very fun. That was nearly two hours. Yeah, she it was two I, hours. Like, used up all my time. Yeah, and all the paint. <laughs> But yeah, that was uh, that was really fun. The two hours passed really, really quickly, and it was funny that we, it was very small. And there were two other couples in there when we got in there, and they were all doing small. One was things. on a first date. It was so awkward. So awkward because never go on a first date somewhere so quiet because we were all just listening to them go. Oh well, sh her going. So so you've got kids. So you've got kids. Um, um what are you doing for Christmas? <laughs> Yeah, it was. Yeah. And it sounded like they knew each other from work as well. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it didn't go well. I don't think they'll be having a date too. I don't think so, because I don't think he was painting anything. I think he was just watching her. And then it was just her asking questions. He didn't ask her any questions. Anyway. Yeah. Um, the couple next to us were students. Yeah, but everyone was painting small things. Me and Keegan walk in, I go, Vars! Keegan's like, oh, a jug! And like the audacity it, on us. Just go, yeah, go in, be big, yeah. be bold, be beautiful. Be beautiful. I thought it was good. My jug was 32 pounds, Keegan's was 40. Yeah. And, but, but I think that's good. You pay that in a shop. Yeah, and you don't pay for the. The experience. You don't pay, pay for the experience. You just you don't pay, pay for, what for you're the doing. paint. So the cost of the jug is the cost of being in the shop. Yeah, the paint. The paint. The, the firing she, it gets dipped in a clear glaze and then the firing in the kiln yeah so like this good. The actual cost of the jug thing yeah for every, like is and i realized keegan's jug is so big that it's um a vase, a vase and a jug so that's a actually good value a or plug a, or a jar a jars. Anyway, I think we might go off and have a late lunch slash early dinner and then we're sorted and can go home and chill Need for the walk. rest of the day. Need to walk the dogs. And walk the dogs. Oh, that's cute though. Oh. Here we are at Nando's. I think last time we were here, this was over a year ago when we went to Edinburgh. Was it? It was during that time. So we came here for Nando's, then we went over the road for Krispy Kreme. We love the Nando's. We do. I just think it's like a good, healthy, but good, like the food's decent yeah. for a chain. Definitely. It's all trackable as well on my fitness pal. Dog walking now, post Nando's. Look at the wonderful sunset over there. Beautiful. The temperature's dropped. Yeah, it has. Fenton is jumper and a coat. Ava's naked. 